Well, good afternoon to you. Things had been building up very nicely over the last couple of days in the lead-up to this game, but as you can see, the last couple of hours are a rather different story. The weather has decided not to play ball. The conditions here are a long way from ideal. It is teeming with rain, and that has left both teams contemplating very different challenges. It's almost old-style. Understandable looks of concern on the faces of managers, officials, players and fans alike. Certainly this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. And here is the national anthem of Peru. Well, they have thrown down the gauntlet with that anthem. Now to match it. Hello, guys. Welcome to my Sports Hub gaming channel. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Yeah, Nicolas Otamendi. He's a, a fine defender, both in the air and on the ground, and a, a real tough competitor who, who loves a physical duel. He knows how to pick out a pass too, and he'd be looking to get his team moving forward as soon as any opposition attack breaks down. He often likes to step into midfield. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. There's the whistle. Paredes. Di Maria. And let down by a lack of accuracy. Andre Carrillo. Martinez. And it's Messi. Driving on, he could shoot here. And he's there to cut it out. Well, I don't think it was the wisest option, Peter, once he got into that position. It's not as if he didn't have people nearby. Martinez. Andre Carrillo. Andre Carrillo looking to run onto it. Good clearance and very necessary. Battles to win it back. Paredes gets it out to the wing. Lo Celso, and here's Di Maria, Di Maria, he's got options in the box if he gets his head up, it's a brilliant interception, away from immediate danger, Di Maria, and goes back Paredes 
Well, the fact that we haven't had an attempt on goal is becoming a, an embarrassing reflection on these teams. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Messi. He's made good progress from a deep position. A really good feat from him. Great leap! He's done well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. Peru can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Good idea, just poorly executed. Martinez gets flagged offside. Tries to get it forward quickly. Guerrero just brushed off the ball there. Otamendi gets it away. Foot in. And it's Messi. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? It'll be a throw in. Cueva. Andre Carrillo. Forward it goes. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. And here's Messi. Oh, he's made sure that that won't get through. Messi. Martin and Martinez! Andre Carrillo. Now it's Di Maria. Martinez. Got a shot away. Cueva. Balls come loose and the chase is on. Oh, that's nice. Pass it out wide now. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. <laughs> and there is the half time whistle. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. And we are up to the break. Argentina really did turn up the tempo at the end of the half, and while they'll be disappointed not to have broken through, obviously, the chances will come, provided they can keep producing good spells. It's been a half with significantly more positives than negatives, I feel. Well, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Guerrero. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Cueva. Clears it out of harm's way. Di Maria absolutely focused then on the defensive side of his game. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. Andre Carrillo. 
Di Maria gets it back. It's gone out for a throw in. Guerrero. Good challenge, he just stood firm. He ran himself into trouble there, free kick given away. Uh, the ref's been lenient here, I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Fantastic! Well, clearly there was some serious talking done in that dressing room during the break because they've started this second half with much more intent and the captain's finish was sublime. Just the ideal tonic for the remainder. And he's produced a beauty. Peru break the deadlock. Well, listen, a few words of advice and encouragement from the manager during the break can often straighten things out, and it's paid off here. Messi. And it's Di Maria. Paredes does well to read it and intercepts. Martinez, Martinez, he scored! Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Argentina grab the equaliser and we're all square well there's resilience for you Peter as a side they never lost focus despite the setback and this is thoroughly merited for me now they can go on better possibly just brushed off the ball there now it's Messi Messi plotting from out on the right hand side now, managed to get it away Celso Di Maria plays it out to the wing Los Celso Danger averted for now Out for a throw Gets the better of his man Guerrero Chance and he's there to hoof it away. Di Maria. Cueva. Well, it did look promising to start with, but in the end they were thwarted before they could even make it into the final third. That's a decent... And Martinez! It's off target and by quite a way. If he sacrifices some power, he may control the elevation.
and it's Carrillo. Guerrero, a scorer already in the game. Cueva plays it out to the flank. Cross deflected behind for a corner. Peru can make their change now with uh, a break in play. Otamendi gets it away. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Peru showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. Oh, how's that for a goal? He's got himself a pitch of a goal. And again, they hit the front. Oh, that is a bit special. Peru take the lead. Look, I just think they've kept at it, got their reward. Now they need to hang on to it. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. The Celso. Assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Argentina are looking desperate here, short on time and options. At least they're going about it as they should, having brought this on themselves. Guerrero, he's left his man, now it's Carrillo, Acuna battles to win it back. Peru certainly don't need to overcommit now, their priority lies further back. Argentina are running out of time to save themselves. Carrillo. Acuna gets him to thwart him. Keeper has beaten it away. Messi. A good challenge, stood up well against his man. Guerrero. Cueva. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. That's going to be a booking. Acuna, Di Maria. Cueva. And the referee brings it to a close. A fine advertisement for attacking football, a really entertaining game. So many talking points. In a way, a shame anybody had to lose. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim?